Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to buy the Must token using Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap. I'm going to be showing you guys step by step everything that you need to do in order to purchase this token. But before we get started, I just want to remind everyone I do have daily cryptocurrency tutorials coming out on this channel. So if you guys are interested in crypto and you want to learn how to buy, how to sell, and lots more, I'd really recommend subscribing to the channel as I'll have lots of content coming out into the future. Uh, but first thing that you want to do uh, once you want to purchase the Mist token is head over to Trust Wallet and open that up. Once you're in Trust Wallet here, I just want to tell you guys I'm not going to show you how to create your Trust Wallet or how to transfer your BNB or purchase BNB inside of this video. If you guys need to know how to do either of those things, I will have tutorials in the description for both of those things if needed. Otherwise, I'm going to assume you already have your BNB in your Smart Chain wallets. But once you have that done and you have your BNB in your Smart Chain wallets, you just want to get the contract address for the missed token and you want to paste it inside of Trust Wallet. So I'll have a link in the description for CoinMarketCap where we're going to copy the contract address for this token and then paste it into our Trust Wallets. So if you just head over to CoinMarketCap right here, you can just go ahead and down to where you see the contracts and just copy this contact address. Once you copy the contact address, you can head back into Trust Wallet and you want to go to the top right of your screen where you see the two lines and two circles. Click on that. Then you just want to paste in the top search bar here the contact address. You just want to go ahead and enable it and then click on done. Once you guys have the missed token inside of your Trust Wallet, you can then go over to PancakeSwap and there will be a link for PancakeSwap in the description and in the comment section as well. So you can just go ahead and click on that for PancakeSwap. And once you're in PancakeSwap, all you want to do on PancakeSwap is go to the top left of your screen where you see the three lines. Click on that. Then you just want to click on trade and then exchange. Once you guys do that, you can go to the top right corner and you want to click on the connect button to connect your wallet. And instead of clicking on Trust Wallet right here, you actually want to click on Wallet Connect first and then click on Trust Wallet. Once you do that here, you'll get this connecting screen. So we'll just give this a second to load up and then it's just going to tell us to connect to uh, PancakeSwap. So we'll just give this a second to load up. There we go. And you just want to click on connect and it'll tell you right here to go back to your browser. So we just head back over to our browsers and we'll know our wallet's connected when we see our wallet address up in the top right corner as well as our balance of BNB right there as well. Uh, and if you guys don't see your balance of BNB there, you just want to make sure again that your BNB is in your smart chain wallet. If it's in your smart chain wallet, then it will then show up here in your balance. So what you want to do now is click on select a currency and you want to paste that same address we got from CoinMarketCap right here as well. And then right here, you'll see the missed token. You just want to click on import on that. And then right here, you'll see that it's added in here and we have the BNB and missed swap here. And all you want to do is type in the amount of BNB that you want to transfer over. So we can just type in the amount here. Let's just say if it was 0 0.2, type that in. Then it will show me the amount of missed I'll get for the 0 0.2 BNB. And then all we have to do now is make sure that our slippage tolerance is on 7%. And to do that, you just want to go to right percent exchange where you see the three lines. Click on that. And then right here, just type in 7%. And then we can exit out of here. And then uh, you just want to click on where it says insufficient BNB balance for me. For you, it should say swap. And then it'll show you a broken down version of your transaction, showing you your rates and your fees and things like that on the next screen. And if you guys are happy with that, you click on swap again, and then you will get the successful transaction notice. Once you get that notice, you can exit out of here and then head back over to Trust Wallet. And you can just cancel out of this. And then your coins will then appear in your screen, usually within a couple minutes. Anyhow, I really hope I was able to help you guys out, showing you guys how to buy the missed token using Trust Wallet and PancakeSwap. If this video did help you out, be sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.